Yeah, well, what we do is we plant uh, plant all the crops in late August, early September, and let them start growing. And we try to grow them as slow as possible um, because, and I have a sister from Florida, and she does terrible in the cold here. So um, we try to grow everything as cold and slow as possible so that it's strong enough and thick enough to last all the winter. But then start uh, we start harvesting our spinach, which is our main crop. We start harvesting our spinach. Uh, late October, early November, we really want it to freeze, and it's hard. Uh, we don't have any end walls on our hoop at the time, but it's still hard to get it to freeze because it's the freezing that makes it sweet. Somehow it turns the starches to sugar. Um, I'm not sure the process because I don't think I've ever taken a biology class in my, in my life, but uh, you know, it, it, so it does that with a lot of crops. Uh, broccoli will get sweeter in the cold. Um, like Brussels sprouts, if you were to eat them, you shouldn't eat them until after they freeze. Um, so the more the spinach freezes, and we let our hoops freeze, we hope they freeze every night. Um, usually our enemy, except for six weeks of the winter, is heat. You know, we're trying to keep everything cool enough. Uh, and then we just keep harvesting all winter and keep things cold. And we'll, you know, heat to thaw stuff out, but not heat to grow, because heating to grow would never, would never pay back.